Okay. Well, I'm not going to sell myself, but I'll introduce myself. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm Patrick Murphy. I'm in my first term on the city council, and, uh, and I hope it won't be counted against me that uh, I don't have enough time in the two minutes uh, now to fit all I've done in the last two years. Um, actually, I hope it works in the opposite way. But I, I do think that beyond just really keeping our streets clean, keeping our buildings safe, keeping our streets safe and the parks and, and all our public safe uh, public spaces uh, that way, which is really a basic function of our city government. I think beyond that, what this forum is really about is the, the built environment of the, of the city. It's about the form, about the, the design of the city and how that really interacts with its inhabitants, us. How we um, really not only respond to the built environment, but how the built environment reflects our own values. And so I think we have to not only address those really basic needs that, that are expected of all of our, uh, our city government, uh, but also consider these other issues that are really larger than, than that. Um, and, and I've been working on that throughout my, my term on the council. Um, whether it's been about uh, really identifying, oh, we're down to 30 seconds already, um, but we'll, we'll definitely talk a, a lot more, but there's all kinds of issues uh, that, that I've been working on throughout this, uh, this term, and I, I hope uh, if we don't get a chance to talk about them tonight, there's also uh, a website, thinkmurphy.com, and uh, you can talk with me afterwards. Thank you. Well, thanks very much uh, to, to all the neighborhood groups for having me here, and, and I do just want to very uh, briefly go through a number of the issues that have been raised, um, be, because I have been working on, on all of these. Um, we did, as a city council, approve the reorganization of inspectional services, which I think has resulted in, in improved code enforcement. And with the Lowell Stat program, which was a proposal that I had made, uh, we really have put in place, I think, systems which encourage constant improvement. Um, there's a municipal hearing officer, for example, which hears uh, code violations and really quickens the process for uh, those to be taken care of. Um, I worked on the Clemente Park, as was mentioned earlier, with uh, Vesta Noon uh, on that renovation, so that which actually grew into really uh, the Cambodian Town project that will be affecting that neighborhood, the, the Pylon area, for a number of years to come. Worked on adoption of the stretch code and a number of other things, streamlined permitting for uh, uh, homeowners and everything else. So, I'll give you that cowbell. <laughs>